Let's talk about something. Many things come across my mind. It makes me wonder, right? Don't you wonder sometimes? This is a dictionary. We're going to learn a word today. Ready? Subtle. I seen a lot of discrimination since I came down here in the South, but ain't nothing like discrimination when you're in New York. I mean, you know, it, it's very subtle, you know. Let me explain. Most of these schools are in Nassau, Queens, and so forth. Few of them, like three or four of them, are in Suffolk County. The city people always call Suffolk County and Nassau County the real Long Island. Yet, Queens, Brooklyn, Nassau, Suffolk County, that's the, like, isn't that the whole Long Island? They're surrounded by water. Long Island? I mean, not to be technical, but isn't it obvious? It don't matter if you're white, black, purple, orange, you know, don't matter your ethnicity. I can't pronounce the word, so I say ethnicity. It don't matter your race. It doesn't matter. There's always got to be somebody to kick you out. You know, when you got money, money talks, right? Money always talks. Hmm. Hmm. I'm not bashing. I love my New York, but y'all smell really bad, dirty. And I can see that. Most of these schools that are on this list are upper class schools. How I know that? Just trust me, I lived in Long Island for a long, long time. Over 20 years. This email that I got is telling me that these are the, 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 the schools that most graduates and all that. Yeah, but, but who's the one that's paying you to say that? How they're explaining it is like no other school in, in Brooklyn, Queens, Nassau County, or Suffolk County, kids don't graduate as much as these schools. You don't see North Babylon High School on there, do you? But you see a lot of people graduating there too. For instance, did you know Steve Ballone, right? He graduated from North Babylon High School. He's a legislator of Suffolk County. Like, are you kidding me? 